Uh, good morning, uh, it's Uncle Lou here. Uh, yep, that's right, it's me, Uncle Lou. Live for you on YouTube today. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, really appreciate it. Subscribe if you're not already. Uh, yeah, uh, watch Uncle Lou videos every day like you're supposed to. Make you smarter and lower your cholesterol too. Oh, which is good. Get you off of that Lipitor, which is killing you uh, from the inside out. Oklahoma. All right, brief. This this is my brief initial uh, like thoughts on Oklahoma without really digging into it uh, too much. Uh, just sort of. Uh, obviously, I had no idea we'd be playing Oklahoma all year. So uh, you know, it's not like I I, I watched them every week. Uh, I did watch quite a, f a few uh, Oklahoma games. Didn't watch them all. Uh, so th this is just sort of my brief initial uh, thoughts or whatever on Oklahoma uh, based on what I've seen so far uh, this year and, and, and what I know so far this year uh, from what they've done. All right, we'll start with the positive. Baker Mayfield is obviously an elite quarterback. I mean, there's no denying that. There's no point even really trying to trash talk Baker Mayfield's quarterbacking. Um, ability. The guy's elite, most likely going to win the Heisman here uh, coming up pretty soon. Uh, so, you know, that just is what it is. Baker Mayfield, an elite quarterback. Their offensive line is pretty good. They do a good job protecting him. Uh, nothing much to say bad, really, about the offensive line. Uh, they've got uh, a couple of uh, guys in particular that are really, really good. Probably got NFL careers. I think they've got a, a two all Big 12 linemen. I don't know if they're all Americans or not. Uh, but anyway, so a good offensive line, uh, really good offensive line, and an elite quarterback. Running back. They've got one decent running back. Uh, he didn't even have a 1,000 yards. No, he didn't even say, well, Oklahoma's a, a, a passing team. Okay, I, I'll give you that. They are a passing team. Nevertheless, you got one decent running back. Um, Anderson, is that his name? This dude would be lucky to be on the punt team uh, at UGA just to be real about it, if I'm going to give Oklahoma credit for Baker Mayfield being an elite quarterback and Oklahoma having a great passing game, uh, then don't get in the comment section and try to tell me that Oklahoma's running backs can compete uh, with UGA's running backs. They just can't. Uh, we, we've got three or four NFL running backs on the team this year. That's just a fact. Uh, if you want to make yourself look stupid and try to argue that Oklahoma's got better running backs than Georgia, go ahead. Uh, I'll laugh at you in the comment section, as will anybody that has any college football sense at all uh defense uh what defense oklahoma you ain't got no damn defense i mean uncle lou's not telling you anything you don't already know uh now like i said haven't studied uh, a bunch about oklahoma or really looked into them all that much not knowing all year long that we'd be playing them but i'm gonna tell you what i do know your defense is terrible awful um and, and, and that's not even necessarily a knock against oklahoma particularly the Big 12 as a whole just doesn't play defense. Um, this isn't new. This isn't breaking news. This isn't even fake news or alternative facts. I mean, th this is just, people have known this uh, for years now. The, the Big 12 is just a track meet. That's it. And congrats to Oklahoma. You have the best passing game in a pass-happy league, and you won the Big 12. Uh, what'd you finish? 12-1, and one, right? Uh, lost to Iowa State. Uh, yeah. Oh, you don't just walk into Ames, Iowa. Walk out with a win, Uncle Lou. Okay, whatever makes you feel better uh, or sleep good at night. Uh, but back to your Swiss cheese defense. Your defense is garbage. Just, just garbage. I mean, that's just. I don't. What else do you want me to say? Your defense is terrible. If you know, in years past, you had an above-average defense. Okay, not just for the Big Twelve, but just in general. There has been years in the past where you had an above-average defense. This ain't one of them years, Jack. Uh, it's just not. Your defense is terrible. Um, here, listen to this. This is one stat I looked up because I was arguing uh, with one of these boomers assuming land thieving, cheating engines uh, the other day. <coughs> uh, yeah. Uh, listen to this now. Oklahoma against the run. 40th. 40th. Now, I just told you the Big 12 is a passing league. That wasn't news to you. You knew that. No one can run the ball. No one runs the ball in the Big 12. They don't even try, right? So how is it possible that you've got the 40th best run defense? 40. There's not a single Big 12 team in America that's even in the top 20 in rushing. Yet you're 40th against the run. That's bad news. That's bad news for you. 
that's bad news for you. And you're gonna say, because this is what you keep saying. UJ is one dimensional. UJ is one, you're one dimensional. You throw the ball. We run the ball. Okay? That's just the way it is. That's just the way it is. But what wins championships? Defense. Yeah, defense. Defense wins championship. That's not an Uncle Louism. Uh, that's not an old wives' tale, even though even an old wife uh, would know that. Uh, that's just a fact uh, of football. Defense wins championships. And Oklahoma, oh, 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 we've owned the SEC, Lou. Uh, check our record all time against the SEC. Yeah, but check it in check it in playoff or bowl games. Check it in bowl games when it matters. When you're going against the good SEC teams, check it. Losing record. Losing. You lose when you play good SEC teams in bowl games overall. You, you, and, and, and I don't care about the past. This is for Oklahoma fans who keep type, 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 wipe the drool off. Type, 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 that you've got a winning record against the SEC. Congrats. But look at bowl games, losing record. So that's just my rebuttal of that. But your defense is absolutely terrible. You can't stop 40th against the run in a league that don't run the ball. Bad news. Bad news for you. You gave up 30 or more points in almost half your games. I think it was five or six games. There's at least five I can think of off the top of my head that you gave up 30 or more points. That, that ain't no defense. That ain't no defense. Oh, but on glue, the Big 12 passed the ball so they, so they score more. That's why. The Big 12 is garbage, sir. The fourth best team in the Big 12 is Iowa State. That, that's your fourth best team. Don't take Uncle Lou's uh, word for it. Google the, Google the standings in the Big 12. Iowa State finished fourth with a record of 7-5. and five. The same record that Missouri had. Missouri! They're like the 10th or the 11th best team in the SEC and they went 7-5. and five. Your, fourth, your fourth best team went 7-5. and five. No good teams out there. Baylor. Baylor! Wouldn't they go 1 and 11? Put up 41 points on you? 41? <laughs> Listen, for, 41 points to Baylor? Oh my God. <laughs> That's sad. Kansas State, uh, 35 points. Can't, 35! You let Skeletor, Bill Snyder, score 35 points on you. Yeah, you beat him because you outscored him 42 to 35. Congratulations. You beat Kansas State 42 to 30. You gave up 35 points to Kansas, Kansas State. Vanderbilt beat Kansas State 14 to 7. 7. 7. <sighs> Lou. Lou, we're going to stack the box. We, 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 we got Georgia figured out. We're going to stack the box, Lou, and try to shut the run game down, make Jake Fromm uh, have to pass to beat us. We know, we know that's what you're going to do. Hey, hey, 12 teams have tried that this year. 12 teams have failed. Oh, you lost to Auburn. But we beat Auburn, so that's 12 teams, 12 W's. All 12 had that same plan. And at least half of those teams have a way better defense than that Swiss cheese Oklahoma defense. Just reality. That's it. That's just reality. I, look, listen, I gave you credit. Passing offense, elite. Baker Mayfield, elite. Heisman winner, most likely. That'd be my pick anyway, Okay. A decent running back that almost got a thousand yards. He got about as many yards as our second string running back did, okay? But your defense is terrible. Defense wins championships. Georgia is going to stay on the field. Baker Mayfield is going to stay on the sideline. Look, you're going to get your points, okay? You're, you'll get your points. Now, this will be the best defense you've played by far, by far. This will be the best defense you've played. Okay? So, what, what are you averaging a game? 40? 40? 45? Whatever it is? You won't get that. You won't get that. Baker Mayfield will be on the sideline. 
The running game of UGA will pound, pound, pound. And that's just going to be what it is. But keep watching, Oklahoma fans, because Uncle Lou has plenty more for you.